Hello, it's Lucifer for here. Uh, today we're going to do a review and some gameplay on the uh, the Japanese heavy, the Oni. First things first, get to the engine, which has 1,100 horsepower, 11 horsepower per ton. Top forward speed is 25 kilometers per hour. Top reverse speed is 10 kilometers per hour, with a fire chance of 20%. Alright, <laughs> to the gun, the 15 centimeter howitzer. Reload time of 23 seconds, which is terrible. Aiming time of 3.5, which is terrible. Accuracy at 100 meters, 0.56, is terrible. Uh, max elevation of 20 degrees, and a max gun depression of 10 degrees. But that's not, that's not an entirely accurate. Uh, especially when the gun's pointed forward. We'll get to that in the gameplay and I'll show you more of what I'm talking about. Um, the next, we'll get to the radio. Uh, signal range is 425 with a view range of 380, which is comparable to tier, uh, tier 9's heavy. Uh, penetration on your APHE is 91 through 151 millimeters. Whether your damage coming in, that's 525 through 875. Your HE penetration is 56 through 94 millimeters, with damage ranging between 683 through 1138. Uh, velocity goes up a little bit higher in your HE, only by 40. Uh, next, we'll get to the armor. As you can see by the front, the mantlet is 191 to 230. The cheeks are pretty good armor at 121 through 160. The front plate 121 through 160 and most people like to call them the boobs but they're actually just the small gun turrets on the front. Uh, they're armored fairly well too. Uh, you can see the cupola up top 121 through 160 except for right on the top sides or its weak spot 31 through 50 millimeters of armor goes through it pretty easily no real problems there side of the turret pretty well armored and again you can see the boobs <laughs> they're still fairly well armored uh, now we'll take a look at the back 121 through 160 on the rear plate not angled very well but still good uh, back of the turret same 121 through 160 uh, very good if you're in an RD and you see one of these they're pretty easy to chew apart as you can see it's 31 uh, through 50 millimeters of armor so they're pretty easy just to blow apart there uh, we're going to get into some gameplay here. I can show you what I mean about the uh, the gun depression uh, and why this. I'm not really a big fan of the Japanese heavy line uh, because of how slow they are. Uh, I prefer some a little bit more bit more mobility. I don't like the gun handling, but when you do land a shot, it sure you know you do a lot of damage. Big alpha. But uh, reload time was, what I say, 26 seconds, which is, that's, that's horrible. Uh, but map is highway, standard battle. And of course, we're going to go uh, towards the town. Because we're not, this tank is not meant for sniping at all. We were, we're no point in even trying that. Uh, Accuracy was 0.56. I mean, it's terrible. Uh, but we'll get to that here in a minute. Traverse speed for some odd reason. Okay. The controller messed up for a minute there. So I'm just gonna knock this AMX AC46 around a little bit. And I guess I turned my inverted or something off or on. Kind of gave me a little bit of a 
problem there. But uh, turn our turret to the side. As you can see, it go it goes down pretty good. Okay, when you have it towards the front, as you can see, not so much. It doesn't go down great at all. It's not till you turn to the side you get that full 10 degrees gun depression. Uh, towards the rear, you can get the full uh, 10 degrees gun depression. Uh, long, I don't this I wouldn't call this rough terrain. We're going 25, 24 miles per hour, which I think it's top. That's pretty much it was its top speed. Uh, it's a brawler. You know, it's meant to, uh, to brawl. It's not a sniper whatsoever. Uh, they do have an arty on the enemy team, and I'm sure he would love to uh, <laughs> track me and get me out in the open, and I'd be just a, a mark of excellence for him almost. Of course, there's no good with a mark of excellence on an arty. <laughs> Can't see the damn barrel anyway. All right, so zoom in, and we have a nameless, one of my favorite tanks. Go ahead and zoom all the way in, and we'll take a shot. It bounces, of course. Uh, no big surprise there, but I know for a fact, I don't think we have the gun accuracy to hit him there, but lower plate, if I can get it to him, get into his side, I know I can hurt him, but he's done for anyway. Uh, we got more company that IS-3 is trying to deal with, but enough camping here. Let's get up there and start getting into it a little bit more. I'm just gonna pull out and keep taking shots at him. There's nothing I can do for him because I'll wind up in the same situation he's in. The only thing I can do, damn it. I hit him in the tracks, didn't. All right. The IS-3 will pin us up front. Now, see, they're already starting, but the Gornich here, I've destroyed a many of these. I don't think I have the gun accuracy to really hit him where I need to. No, I don't. Uh, this is kind of a lost cause because I know that this tank is just, it's running on its last leg pretty much anyway. But we're gonna try anyway. Uh, I had a game just like this last match and it just keeps going on and on. Uh, I got, I actually up, I actually got the video ready to upload, and it was the same kind of thing. Everybody went the other direction. Nobody goes where they're supposed to go. I mean, not where they're supposed to go, but nobody. The coverage isn't. You know, I, I'm almost ashamed to upload this because you, can, I can't even find a good game to put this tank in. So I'm gonna go ahead and upload it with the review, and. You lemon train people, stop. Alright, if you would, please like and subscribe. And...